I've got a bit of a hobby and um, it's just something that stuck with me all my, all my life. And uh, I, liked, I like economics. Um, I guess because we're in a capitalist system, it's good to see where the money's going. And um, it served me well because when you can trace the money, you can see who's doing what and why they're doing it. 2015, a lot of people are stating is going to be maybe a bit of a boom for the United States. And uh, although the American dollar, the greenback, is, is increasing in value, which does help them because their purchasing power goes through the roof and they're able to access more and more plastic crap from China. And in turn, if China's busy, then they, they buy resources from all the resource wealthy nations like Canada, Brazil, Chile, Australia. I believe that 2015 is going to see a focus, um, although we've had the whole Ebola issue in um, Western Africa, um, it's going to focus on Africa. I believe the, the elites in 2015 are going to set down, set down the parameters, the protocols, in order to get in there, organise their own puppet regime, which they have been doing for the last 30, 40, 50 years, especially nations like Britain have taken, taken you know, ridiculous advantage of the Africans over the last 50 years and other nations through the slave trade, which is just disgusting uh, hundreds of years before that. Africa is, is just one big peach ready for everybody to take a bite out of. And of course it's lacking, um, it's lacking peace and it needs good governments. And uh, once all these things are integrated, because we've already seen China go there in droves and, and they've built roads and, 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 and schools and hospitals and um, airports, they've, they've done almost anything. Um, a lot of the toilets in a lot of the, especially the, the countries like Nigeria and uh, Sierra Leone, if you go there and the toilets, when you go to the toilets, you'll see that the toilets have actually got uh, Mandarin writing. The male and female is written in Mandarin and English. Um, so they've been there for a while. And um, it seems like Obama got a sniff of it about a year ago that, hang on, you know, you know, it's, it's amazing how thick these people are because unfortunately government is like a massive ship. It takes ages to dock it, you know. By the time you get the hordes all agreeing on one thing and everybody gets their kickbacks, you know, it can take forever. But Africa, from 2015 onwards, is going to be a very interesting place to be. In actual fact, if, if, I, was, if I was much younger, I'd probably have packed my bags and already left. I'd be there. There's, there's a lot of opportunities. But it's dangerous. It's a dangerous place. It's a dangerous place. Um, and, and what we've seen now with the Ebola is what people got to realise is now that this whole thing of Ebola, yes, um, a lot of people say it's CIA uh, creation, okay, which most likely, you know, what isn't these days? Um, but now that all these people have died and, and the whole economy, especially Sierra Leone, Liberia, and um, Nigeria got away with it a little bit, um, there's going to be a vacuum left behind. There's going to be a vacuum. It's like no man's land. And sooner or later, all the... Um, all the, the warlords there are going to start fighting, and there's going to you're going to, you're going to notice a lot of uh, a lot of a lot of battles, a lot of um, there's already a lot of fighting concerning uh, groups that are affiliated with Al Qaeda, you know another CIA based thing, uh, Muslim based uh, belief Muslim belief based uh, groups, and there's going to be a lot of um, a lot of room to move there and just watch a lot of the developed countries the french the the germans the english the americans the the chinese even the russians they're going to move move in there big time because everybody's going to be able to um, make some serious money so yes 2015 you're going to see a lot of a lot of incidents and uh, mainstream media will play this out because obviously the consultants in white, the White House, they've um, 
have advised that all that you know that's the place to go for for um, look with technology there's a lot of rare earth minerals in in places like congo and um it, and and uh, you know and there's other areas that haven't even been mined and they will they'll they'll, they'll mine and um they'll put their puppet regimes in place and it'll be a place where a lot of people can make uh, a lot of money yeah i know I, i'm you know i'm uh, i'm saddened by it because normally what happens is they never you know the poor never get any anything out of it if anything they 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 get poorer you know but uh, that's that's the 2015 prediction for me. Okay.